Welcome, this is Man of the Changes. We are back with Dangan Rompa. Goodbye to Swear. Let's begin. Did something happen? I don't know, Hajime. You tell me. Hey, how's everybody? How are you doing? How are you doing? I don't care about you. I don't care about you. I'm Monokuma. Ah, uh, Chiaki. Well? Apparently, Monokuma has something to say. But he's not going to tell us until everyone's together. It's probably something terrible again. Hmm. Terrible? It might be much better if it were just terrible. True. Uh, only other person I care about. Hey, hey! Is Fuiko alright? I think he was trying to flirt with me. You think that was flirting? <laughs> now the person I care about. He's glaring at the bathroom with his eyes full of abnormal malice. Is he really that upset that he can't take a shit? I understand. I understand. I'll be more shit, a bit more pissed about missing my dick in balls, but like I understand. As a person's insides nearly exploded four, on four different occasions, and I don't, I mean that literally, I, 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 my insides actually exploded and I almost died. I understand. Well, for me, it made me never want to take a shit again, but you get the point. Hiya! Yo! How are you guys doing? We are able to get the general idea of Strawberry House's inside. Huh? Strawberry House? Uh, Strawberry House side? That's strange, that's a strange thing to say. Sounds like there are other buildings. Of course! Of course! That's why. There's this thing called a contact elevator. Let me ask. Contact elevator, you say? I can't hear myself. Hey! Even though it's an elevator, it's a big mistake to think that it moves vertically. This is an elevator that travels along a rail, so even moving horizontally is as easy as pie. Then... Does this elevator go to a different building? Yep. That's right. To Grape House. Huh? Grape House? Hey. The um, fun house is an enormous building and it's made up of other buildings. See ya later. Well, we can worry about the details when you get to the Grape House. I'll be going ahead. Huh? Don't really get it, but he said he was gonna, he wanted to tell us to go to the Grape House this time, right? Um. And we must ride that elevator, right? Are we screwed? Oh, uh, what should we do? Show some spirit. Huh. We just have to go for it. The only way we can overcome this situation is to make a move. I mean... But, but still, you know... <laughs> but, you scared? Of course not! Oh, hell no! Why are you saying that in front of Sonya? Huh? Fine, a fucking go. I'm not scared at all. Well, I don't ever despise this guy's Luigi, but I do have a bad feeling about this. But we can't just stand here and do nothing. Alright, let's go. When I press the grape button next to the door, it immediately opened. Everybody sees Ajime as the de facto leader. That's why they let him do everything and they do nothing. And when they need something done, they ask Ajime. Some would say he's the errand boy. I say he's the de facto leader because they wouldn't be functioning without him. That is my point made. We stepped into the elevator and off we went to the grape house. To the trial room, right? Is this or oh yeah? Is this already moving? Hmm. If so, that'd be awesome. How so? Hey. I mean, it's not vibrating at all, right? This is probably a really high-performance elevator. If it's not vibrating all that much. Or what if it's on a rail to turn? Like that. That could be a reason why it's not vibrating. If it's on a rail, if it's turning, you're in a square, but it's turning in a circle. I see what Monokum is doing. He's trying to confuse the shit out of them. Mouth, like mentally. This is, this is all a ruse. This is all a ruse, I say. That's why all the strawberries on the wall and shit. You get sock up syndrome and you'll be like, I'll never eat strawberries again. And then while you're inside the place, you're like, strawberries! Ah, strawberries! Hmm. Maybe it's not actually moving. All right, let's open the door and make sure. You must not. You cannot. That is too dangerous. With the same side, the vibration-free elevator. Eventually, the door in front of us suddenly opened. It appears we've arrived at our destination. 
So this is Grey Pass. No matter where I look, everything is plastered with grape patterns. As the leaves better than strawberry house. All that pink was getting to me. I was already fed up with the strawberry patterns, but this is also unpleasant. But not as unpleasant as strawberries. Welcome! Okay, welcome to the grape house! Now then, allow me to explain the grape house. What? Da da! The grape house is in society! So, let's start explaining the first floor. Uh, aside from the fact that there's no final dating room, it's basically no different than a strawberry house. Just like how there's a strawberry wall over there, there's a grape wall on the side. And when you go through the grape wall, that means there's a grape tower. The second floor of the grape house, it's the same as the second floor of the strawberry house. I've prepared five guest rooms for different types along with a relaxing lounge. But the main attraction of the grape house is obviously the third floor. The Monokuma Archive. Everybody loves the Monokuma Archive. If you want to know about my proud accomplishments and contributions, feel free to study literature here. Hmm. Now then, this includes a tour. This concludes a tour. But I believe it'd be difficult to understand if I explain it with just words. So you should all use your own two feet to check out the inside of the building. Hmm? That's all from me. Any questions? Like... Like, I'm starting to get hungry. Where's the food anyway? Huh? Uh, is that necessary? Hey. Oh, what, what are you saying? Of course it is. <laughs> but... It's supposed to be an escape game. So how can there be any tension if there's no time limit? Yahoo! So, I've decided to use your stomachs as the time limit. Dick move, Monokumo, dick move. Don't tell me. What do you mean? In other words... Well, simply put... Yeah. <laughs> I need to kill someone before you starve to death. Lies. But what, what the heck? <laughs> if you're planning to kill someone, I highly recommend you make your kill as soon as possible. <laughs> It'll be too late if you get so weak you have no energy to kill. Hey! Hey, hey hold on! What? S the starve? Damn it! Damn it! How much more of this can we do, do we have to do until he's satisfied? Um, oh wait, question. Am I right to say this is the first time he's taking an active role in almost killing them? Because in the previous game, he never took an actual role in the motives. At all. To, to me, this is him taking an actual role. Damn it. Huh. He, he was he serious about it being no food? I don't want No, wait, that. that's the one thing I don't want. I don't mind starving as long as I can eat. Just let me eat already. Sheesh. As soon as she learned it was no food, she was overcome by hunger. Obsessions are truly annoying. <laughs> but at least try to stay calm. Now's not the time for you to panic. Hey. Well, being loud here isn't gonna help us. So for now, we should explore the inside of this building too. Right? After all, if you don't give up, you're sure to find hope. Isn't that right, Fuyiko? Huh? Yeah, that's right. All right. Now let's get it started. The same pairing as before is fine, right? Hey, hey, hey! Hold on, this time around, I really want to pair up with Masonya. Like... She already left with Gundam. Hmm. Looks like you're being avoided, not just rejected. Hey. Kazuhichi, I understand that you're feeling down, but we better get going. Damn right. Akani, you too. How much longer are you going to stay shocked? Come on, let's go. With heavy steps, everyone left to explore the grape house. Then... Now then, where should we start? Since we're on the first floor, it might be okay if we start with the grape tower. I see. Hmm. <laughs> so you're saying you're going to start with the most suspicious place? <laughs> All right. Then let's start with the grape tower. <laughs> Let's start with the group! Anyway, let's find the exit. Damn it, there's no way I'm going to let myself start to death in here. You don't have a choice. You don't have a choice. You, you're acting like the sentence is going to make a difference. You don't, you, I'm your conscience, man. I'm as hungry as you right now. Do not... You, yeah, I'm about to slap shit out of you, Ajime. Alright, uh... I'll live with Izan, Sakura, Sakura, Sakura. Big, thick-legged Sakura. Ah... Uh, Ogre, Ogre. She went down with a, with a fight. She went down with a bang. What is this muscular bronze statue? It's probably an ornament, but it doesn't fit the ambience at all. Ah, oh, the name written on you. Hmm? Ogre? Does that mean it's a statue of an ogre? Why is it wearing a sailor uniform? Dumbass. I'm starting to get pumped Look up. at that statue. I'm starting to feel a little excited. What's that mean? Why is there a statue like that in a place like this? I'm gonna do what is it. this creature inside of this building? I don't think so. 
This is probably in the hole just to garnish it. Huh? Garnish? <gasps> you mean like food garnish? Is this food? Is it tasty? It's not food. It's just a decoration. Bathroom. Okay. So there's a bathroom here as well. Regardless, I still cannot shit. That's the only downside to this party. Dick and balls. Dick and balls, I don't know. Manukuma didn't install a dildo, so I don't know what you're talking about. The only downside? Your optimism is praiseworthy. Starving that uh, seems pretty straightforward for Monokuma. <laughs> that piece of shit, how dare he pull such dirty trick on civilians? Um, that doesn't count for you. That doesn't count for you. You're a Yakuza. I don't, I don't count for you. I'm sorry, man. Okay, maybe it's like, it's like, we'll be fine if it were just him, but to the the civilians. I get what you're saying. In that case, it's alright. I'll put my glasses back on. Huh? Great pal, sir. Huh? This place has, ter has terrible taste as well. <laughs> <laughs> to the grape room. Open. Why don't I get to press it? Grape tower is beyond this door, right? Just like strawberry oil. I only need to press this button. Show some spirit! Alright! Leave this to me! Nikomaru raised his voice and vigorously slammed the button more times than he needed to. <clears throat> it's not opening. Huh? That's weird. When we got strawberry oil, this should have opened. What? Tell me it's out of order. Fine. Time for me to break it down. Well, obviously should it obviously shouldn't. <clears throat> huh? Did you hear something? That's when Nikomaru started shouting. The door open. What was that pause just now? Why didn't the door open right away? Because the room turned, changed color. Sad was the, it, that like anybody smart enough would know that the circle in the center would lead to each other. I'm just saying. All right, game. I see. So this is great power. Hmm. <clears throat> the structure of this building doesn't seem all that different compared to Strawberry Tower. Like, I mean, the, like, a smart assumption based on facts would be that Grape and Strawberry Tower are connected in a straight line by the circular room and that the elevator, which is right next to the circular room, sends each other, it would revolve around the circular room. I remember this in the story, like, this is actually true. The building is the same circular shape and the ceiling is just as high and hard to make out. <clears throat> However, this wall is green. Strawberry Tower's wall is red. Yeah, that's just because the walls are different colors. Like, I mean, obviously all the walls are lighted up and shit. So it's easy to like just change the color. Uh, why are you guys so baffled about this? Well, speaking of different, there's something blatantly different over here. Mm. But why did Great Ball's door not open sooner? That's definitely strange. Well, this building's existence is a mystery. On the Grape Tower door at the far back, there's a strawberry image on there. Mm, a strawberry door inside the Grape Tower. That sounds complicated. No, it's a fucking door leading to the strawberry room. And the other side is the door leading to the Grape Room. Why are you guys so stupid? You, this is worse than the, the, the Nahegi not talking to Sakura. It's like the opposite of Strawberry Tower. As I recall, it should be a Grape image on the back door of Strawberry Tower. Huh? Hmm. So on the strawberry side there's a grape door, and the grape side there's a strawberry door. That's even more complicated. <sighs> However, this time, the stone might connect to the outside. Sure. Totally, man. Yay. Woohoo. Yay, yeah, baby! That's what it's all about. Whoa! I see. It's obviously, it's obvious by looking at this map, since there's nothing beyond the far back door of the Grey Pass. Yeah. If so, then the only thing we can do is try it. Hold it. Oh, where the fuck you come from? I heard what you guys are discussing. It would be pointless to even try, I think. What? Oh, what did you just say? Before we get to that, 
Why are you here? Oh, fuck, wrong bus. Who we get to that? Why are you here, Chiaki? Only with Nagito and Kazuichi? Hmm, it's exhausting to be around those two. So you ran away? <laughs> okay, I get it. I would run away too from Komera. Well, and that door doesn't lead outside. I think it's pointless to even try it out. Definitely. <laughs> Definitely, you say? It's rare for Chiaki to be that certain. Yep. I have a good reason for that. I think I found out the secret of the Fauna structure. The secret of the structure? Want me to tell you? Do you want me to explain to you? Well, pay close attention to each house's relationship into respect to its to his respective tower. Uh. Hey, hey. First, try to remember the first floor of Strawberry House. From the elevator, Strawberry Hall's on your left hand side, right? And if you walk along it, you end up with Strawberry Tower, right? Huh? On the other hand, Grape House, from the elevator, Grape Hall's on your right hand side, right? And if you walk along it, you'll end up at Grape Tower, right? Um. Now, here comes the main point. With those two buildings. Whoa! I see you were here all along. Hey, hey, Chiaki, don't go running off on your own. Hey, you disappeared so suddenly. I was worried about you. Kazuichi, Nagito. You... Thanks you disappearance, I was left all alone, Nagito. Man. Huh? Was that annoying for you? That's right! Oh yeah, it was. I don't want to be alone with a creep like you. This is troubling. I see. So it's not just Hajime. You don't trust me either, huh, Kazuichi? Yeah, but he trusts you enough to listen to what you have to say about Hajime. Like, uh, there's not a more flippant character than Kazuichi in this game, and Teru Teru exists, so... Hey! Hey, are you okay? Have you stopped trusting other humans? Shut up! Oh, Shut yeah, up! thanks to you, you bastard! Huh? Oh, you all came. Good timing. We didn't have to waste any time gathering people. Huh? That was quick. Although the investigations would take more time. Well, yeah. There aren't many areas to search, and we didn't find any good clues. Damn it. Right now, the only thing I find out is... I, there's seriously I no food anyway. At all. This ain't funny at all. Damn it! <laughs> it's super painful to die from starvation. Before that happens, why do we, you know, uh, the hamsters can't move get it around. You insolent! You imbecile, what are you implying? Ah! I'm sorry! That was close. Kazuichi, you should be grateful to Sonya. If you'd gotten your hands on my four dark levers of destruction, your body would be incinerated by hellfire. Hey, hey. But are the hamsters going to be okay without food? I shall engulf this world. Fortunately, the flowers blooming in Strawberry House's indoor park are cursed flowers from Hell's Garden. As long as those seeds are there, the four dark divas of destruction shall not lose a single hit point. <laughs> I'm relieved to hear that. Oh, now then, let's listen to your reports and see what you guys have found. Personally, I'd rather let Chiaki continue her talk, but... Oh well, she listen to what everyone has to say. Now then! Is it fine if Gundam Vehicle and I represent our teams and give the reports? Damn right! Yeah, don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> Rejoice, yeah. mongrels. I have discovered something that you fiends will be happy to hear about. Of course! Yes, our team discovery is number one. We shall not lose. I think their priorities are off slightly. Alright, let's listen to Chiaki. Ah, uh, fuck. Gundam it is. <laughs> now then, I shall present you my discovery. Let me tell you. I this. won't let you say such nonsense like I forgot. Monokuma said this himself before we arrived here. He said there are ship bots in the funhouse. Hey, hey! Could it be? <laughs> Kazuichi, and you lonely humans. Kneel. Fall to your knees and show your gratitude to me, the overlord of ice of destroyed world of death. Feast your eyes on this. <laughs> Behold, a motor. It's a shipboard. Wow. It's kind of true. Monokuma specified shipboards, but he did not specify what shipboard. Well, now we know we can't get off the island, so. Based on that, it's an extremely small size, isn't it? This is a video control toy! Fine. Allow me to tell you a little old story. I was born as a result of a union between a human and a demon, and my existence was shunned by both races. 
Perhaps it's because nobody ever has bought me a toy before. But I believe this is truly remarkable. Shut up! Shut I'm not up. asking about that! Uh, you, you mean it's just bought your phone into some radio control toy? Loser! <laughs> you fool, I totally got tricked. I never said a single word about the ship being real. Stupid idiot. Moron. True. Monokuma said jack shit about jack shit. Your own fault, man. Looks like we don't even have the strength to get upset. Hmm. Might be better if we leave him alone for a while. So it's definitely a waste of time to believe Monokuma. So, why? The Monokuma didn't lie. The Monokuma doesn't lie, right? But I don't understand why they always take his words so at face value instead of like trying to like look over the words, look under the words, look behind the words, find the words, try to move the words around, see what's there. I mean, we're in a life or death situation. I would at least expect to check every scenario but fuck man ah, this, is, this is people just fucking annoying when it's not an ultimate detective or a Nayagi then it's annoying but our situation is getting so grim that can't really focus on that right now uh we go damn right sure the others already know but let me tell you just in case the second floor grape house has guest rooms similar to the ones in second floor strawberry house hmm <laughs> But instead of being covered with strawberry patterns, they're covered with grape patterns. Also... Um, also, there's our guest rooms. There's similar lounge here as well. There's also a phone in the lounge too. However, instead of a grape button, what is on the phone is Strawberry House's lounge. There's a strawberry button on the phone in the Grape House's lounge. Now then. I'm just guessing to this point, but... It's possible that we can use the two phones to communicate with each other. For sure. So the picture on the button shows where each phone connects to. The picture on the button shows where each phone connects to. That's probably it. And last but not least, bastard. Now then. Allow me to give you a brief report. Someone like this. Since I'm the one who made the discovery, it's just as important as I am. No good. Which at means all. it's not important at all. Hey, bastard. Just hurry up and say it already. Um... Well, it's about the third floor of the grape house. See? Do you remember what Monokuma said about Monokuma's archive on the third floor? I actually tried to go there. Jeez. Like the name suggests, it was an archive full of stuff about Monokuma. Oh yeah, uh, that button over there. If you were to take that button and press it, you'd gain your memories back. If. 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 Anybody's read the if story. I'm actually going to do the if story once I'm done with this and like I like now I give them edit like my own text now, That's gonna take a while as I do that because of all the editing and the shit needs to be done. So let's wait on that Like the name suggests it was an archive full of stuff about Monokuma Reminding me of the celebrities who built their own memorial in their house or hometown I see rapper Monokuma, hungry Monokuma, present Monokuma, Monokuma from my last game, two statues of Monokuma and it looks like we don't even need to go in there, ever. Actually... Ah, I also found a lost child at the Monokuma archive. A lost child? What? Huh? Where did you go? Hey! Don't just hide, come on out! <laughs> Hello. So the lost child was you. Right? That's how people react, right? I had no idea how you all would act. It's okay, I won't be depressed anymore. I'm used to be treating poorly. How's... <sighs> I was sad to get used to it. <sighs> she seems a little tense. Um. Um, did Monokuma bring you here as well, Monomi? <laughs> yes, I'm sure we're saving myself. I need to get us a trick by him. No! I'm a failure as a teacher. I have no right to, to guide anyone. Like. Uh, nobody here considers you a teacher to begin with. <laughs> but I'm honestly happy that you're here. Hmm? Huh? <sighs> hey, are you, are you a complete stuffed animal? Is there any part of you that's still rabbit meat? I'm expected to be food. Hey, hey. Um, that was the last report, right? And it's okay if I go now. This is what this is what you mentioned earlier, right? About the structure of the funhouse. Let me ask. The structure of the funhouse. Well? Well, I've come to a conclusion. The grapes are they were currently, and the strawberries are they were in earlier. 
I think they're actually the same building. <laughs> the two towers on the same building, you say? <laughs> I see. What makes you think that? See? Their positions. Well? Inside the strawberry house, strawberry hole is on your left. And inside the crepe house, um, the crepe house is to your right. And if so, if you think about it and put these two together, hmm. the two towers are the same building and each house connects to each other. That's the building structure that comes to mind. Hmm, what? So many tower and crepe tower are the same building. But there might be a possibility. Come on, take a look at that door. Isn't that strawberry image that same one as on the elevator and telephone? Then in the same way, wouldn't that image on the door also be showing where it leads to? I see. If that's the case, we mean that strawberry house is beyond that door with a strawberry image on it. Um, as well as the opposite, the grape tower was that the strawberry tower would lead to the grape house. Meaning, we opened the grape old door when it came in here. So Meaning, depending on which tower we use, this tower changes to either strawberry tower or grape tower. Perhaps... Which means, when you look at the other side of the grape old door that we used to come in here... Yep. The grape's picture should be actually be on there. Hey! All you know, we gotta do is confirm it, right? If we can close that door from the other mm. side... Mm, that might be impossible. Huh? Impossible? Why? Well, I'd be a Nikomaru with the first one to enter Grape Tower, right? <gasps> What's wrong with that? Well, when the two into Grape Tower from Grape Hall, didn't it take a little while for the door to open when you press the button? Huh? See? So just as I assumed. How did you know? Um. When I was walking around by myself, I went to Strawberry House for a while. It felt like there was still something I missed when suddenly the Strawberry Hall door automatically closed in front of me. Huh? The door automatically closed? Yep. And afterwards, no matter how much I pressed the button, the strawberry old door wouldn't open. Um... But why? Perhaps... The doors of the strawberry tower and group tower must be designed so that only one can open at a time. See? I mean, if both doors open at the same time, we'd easily find out that both towers are the same building. If that happens, it wouldn't be a fun house anymore, right? Hmm. Then, the reason a strawberry old door automatically closed in front of you so what I mean is... Was it because we opened the grape tower whole door? Yep. When that happened, the grape hole didn't open because it was waiting for strawberry whole door to close. If you think about it... If you think about it like that, it makes sense, right? Like... Like you're saying, all this hard stuff I don't get. But aren't you forgetting the most basic problem? Food, right? The color of the walls in strawberry tower and grape tower are different, you know. There's no way they're the same building. You don't know? You need to notice. It's just lights on the floor being shine on the wall. By reflecting the color light onto white wall, it makes it look like the wall color has changed. Wait! But th then what about the picture on the floor? Isn't that different too? Um... My real floor is just a screen, and the picture is being projected from beneath the floor. In that fact, when you look at it closely, it's not a picture that was actually drawn on the floor. I got it. Oh, I see. Then it's safe to say it's some building, right? But... This is a really important problem. And so isn't it better if we test it out? Test? Um... For example, we should leave something behind you, and we'll all go to Strawberry Tower. Right. And if it's still there, we can conclude that they're the same building, right? I see. Want me to stay then? Hold on! No, that's impossible. There's a sense of preventing that. Huh? Huh? Sensors? Huh? Don't you feel it? There are countless sensors plastered all over the tower's walls and floors. <laughs> Why can't you notice them? Hey, hey! I was surprised that you actually noticed them. Huh? My guess is that the sensor can probably detect any movement within the tower. Hmm. I mean, it reacts, prevents the door from opening. I knew there'd be at least something like that. Hey, by the way, how good is that sensor's performance? Mm. It's quite high performance. It seems that it can even detect your heartbeats and breathing patterns. I get then it. Then it'd be completely impossible for someone to stay behind. Hey, hey! What about Nikomaru? He's a heartless robot. <laughs> <laughs> I have a motor running inside me. As, as good as any human heart. I'm leaving away. <laughs> it's better than a human heart and cannot have a heart attack on you. But if you're in sleep mode, that function will come to a stop too, right? Sheesh! Like you said, if I had seized all functions with sleep mode, 
the sensor would detect it, but... Shushin! Do you need to go that far to test it? I won't tolerate any robo-prejudice. <laughs> Sorry, you are right. Mm. A donut and once I enter sleep mode. Why not regain consciousness until the good night switch is pressed all again, or if my chest alarm goes off? <laughs> I'm a little concerned about being left alone in that state. You excellent fool! It is far too dangerous, even as an experiment. It's possible that we might violate the laws of robotics. Hey, hey! And why don't we just use this? My student handbook. I'll leave this handbook here. We all move over to the strawberry tower. And if by chance the handbook is still there, we can safely say that the two towers are the same, right? You're right. Let's try this. We left behind Chiaki's e-handbook right away. Then we left Grape Tower and made our way to Strawberry Tower. <sighs> Alright, so... Uh, I could talk to everybody, but my voice is getting kind of fucked up here right now. Like, you get the general point. Anybody gonna talk about uh, Ogre over there and on? Jeez, well... Yeah, shut up, Nakomeda. Okay, let's go. Wow. I see, I see. I, I must say, this elevator is rather quiet. It's like the toad's what? Oh, wait, never mind. Hey, hey! Toad's what? What's he talking about? Mm. Doesn't feel like you're moving extremely fast. It seems you're moving very slowly. If so, the two houses might be surprisingly uh. close. If two towers are connected in the middle of the distance between, there shouldn't be that much. Alright, let's head over to the strawberry tower. It is time. Be free, my pet. Be free. Oh, what the fuck? You leaving? Snack at me. Wants to give me something. I just want to come with coins, ramen and coconut juice. Goodbye, Snake Emmy. <laughs> they grow up so fast. Uh. That was my snake. If you press the button next to this door, you should be able to enter Strawberry Tower. Hey, hey. And I'll press it. Stay back. Wait. Step aside, you fiends. What? The story of evil. In accordance with our ancient contract, the time has come to lend me your aid. My god. He's transforming into his final form. Go, my four dark devas of destruction! BS Rue, Supernova, Silver Fox, Sandy! Choo choo. Ah! Press the button. <laughs> Truly, this is the Skyland lamentation art of the Demon Mouse. <laughs> Soon, the door of destiny shall open. Wow! Amazing! Your hamsters are truly skilled. So you have appeared. Your eyes have managed to follow Sandy's movements. As expected of a dark lady, you have my praise. Amazing! You must have a strong, trusting relationship with them. Th th thank, thank you. you. Th th thank you. Huh? You didn't need the bottom make your hands to press it. Hmm. Just as I thought. It's taken a while to open. Hmm. Considering what we discussed earlier, the sensor will confirm that nothing's moving inside the tower. Then wait for the door to close. <coughs> that moment, I heard a loud sound from the other side of the door. My! Look over there! The moment we set foot inside the strawberry tower, Sonia raised, the, Sonia raised the voice. When I looked where she was pointing, it's there. The handbook. Yep. There's no doubt. It's my student handbook. Huh? If I, if I, if I have a left in Grape Towers here, yeah, then that means. <laughs> it seems that we've confirmed it. Yep. Strawberry Tower and Grape Tower are actually in the same building. And depending on whether you enter from Strawberry Hall, Grape Tower, Wait, or strawberry or grape ball, the tower becomes either strawberry tower or grape tower. Huh? Then the door over there with a the grape image on it. I see. It's not the exit, but it appears it connected to Grape House's grape hall. This is trouble. But it also means that we have no idea where the exit is. Hey. Well, I guess that can be helped. There's no way we'd actually find the exit that easily. <laughs> oh, anyway, I'm surprised. I can't believe you already uncovered a secret like this. 
As expected of Chiaki, you are truly amazing. Normally all you do is stand in space, but at times like this you really pull through for us. However... Why is this building designed so strangely? You're so evil! It's probably no reason. It's simply because it's a fun house. That's all the reason Marukumi needs. Hmm. Um, who are you again? That's... Oh, Marukumi, why did you forget about me? <gasps> that reminds me. What happened to the Monokuma announcement? Huh? What do you mean? According to my internal clock, it's already past 10 p.m. Oh my! Is it that time already? Damn it! Despite that, why isn't there being a Monokuma announcement? Monokuma appears! Allow me to answer. Every single day up till now, I've consistently let you know in the morning and night on this island. And thanks to that, you've been able to live a normal life. You guys... Did you guys mistake me for some pretty long clock? Hello. How oh, well, it's totally true, I'm pretty, but... <laughs> hey, what are you trying to say? Hmm. For the time being, the Monokuma announced it's on Iris. You can go outside and there's no windows here, so it's not that it matters if it's morning or night. <laughs> also, I've been thinking of a little something to replace the Monokuma announcement. <laughs> I don't like this. What's wrong with him? Well... If there's no announcements, we can just look at the clock. Um... Both Strawberry House and Grape House have clocks on their first lounge full of lounges. <laughs> Even if I don't look at a clock, I have my internal clock, so there's no problem for me anyway. But it's already past 10 p.m., right? I'm starting to feel sleepy after hearing that. Hmm. So we don't have food, it might be better if we rest and conserve our energy. Hey. For now, let's just decide our room assignments. Room assignments? Um... Each house has five guest rooms. So should we first decide who's going to stay in which house? Hmm... Why do we make things simple and split them between boys and girls? Yes! Let us do that! Man... That's a bummer. But, well, I guess it makes sense. This too... Then ladies the first. Now then, let us begin! Now then, kittens, choose which house you would like. Um... Let's choose Grape House. Starting at the Red Room is just going to straight... Staring at the Red Room is just going to strain my eyes. Oh! Then the men shall have the strawberry house. Strawberries are known for passion. Hey. Also, each house has guest rooms for varying quality, right? Damn right. Wasn't it two deluxe rooms, one standard room, or two crummy rooms? For now. I we need to decide those next, huh? But there are only five rooms in each house, right? Then one guy will be left over. Sure. That means there's only one appropriate way to settle this. Appropriate way? Rock, paper, scissors, of course. Suddenly, the rock, paper, scissors battle between six guys had begun, and the results... <laughs> Sorry, I ended up winning so easily. The fuck when you play rock, paper, scissors against Cometa, that makes zero sense to me. That's right, I totally forgot that Nagito is the ultimate lucky student. <laughs> so I, it's like second place, that's fine. I was getting bored of being, always being on top. Was that an innuendo? Huh? It's decided. You two will get the deluxe room. Now then, regarding the third win. <laughs> <laughs> I will be resting in the standard room. Why do you need a room, you robot? Damn right. Me and Kazubicho are next. Man. I get the crummy room, huh? Why is better than rooming with someone? <laughs> That's unfortunate, Ajime. You can rest in the lounge, but try not to catch a cold. Hey. How about your grape house girls? Did you all pick your rooms as well? Yep. Yeah, we did. We had a brief discussion and settled things smoothly. Sonia and I have the deluxe rooms, and apparently Connie wants one of the crummy rooms. Huh? Huh? Why do you choose the crummy room? There's still a standard room left over. It's not like that. It's not good enough for me. You guys might think it's pretty crappy, but it's a palace compared to my home. Um... So this is a standard room and a crummy room left. <laughs> Hajime, if you would like, please use one of them. Huh? Hey, hey, hey! You, you can't do that! Oh, my! Why not? Well... I mean, it's dangerous. Hajime might be the traitor, you know. Um... What are you saying? Miss Sonia? Oh, what, what, what am I? Uh, huh? So... We haven't done it, Hajime, at all. Like... Even I don't think it tried to trick us. <laughs> it seems like you're the only one who thought Hajime is suspicious. Hey! Really? Of all people, you're gonna say that. You're really gonna say that. Right? Hajime, you can use one of our leftover rooms. Thank you. I'll feel bad about using the standard room, so I'll stay in the crummy room. Bruh? As your conscience here yeah, and someone concerned for your health, can we please go to the standard room? But even so, it really helps that I have a place to sleep. Oh! Now then, it's decided. We should turn in for the day. Aw, oh, man. It, 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 like, doesn't make any sense. 
And so all the guys except for me ended up staying at the night, staying the night on the second floor of Strawberry House. All the girls plus my leftover self stayed on the second floor of the Crepe House. This is where the harem begins. This is where the harem begins. He said he's going to stay in the crummy room. He did not specify which crummy room. He did not say the other crummy room. It could be the crummy room with Akane. Let's just fantasize and imagine that was the case. And that was the case. For this is how the harem begins. This is how the harem begins. See man over there, cringes. Once you like, subscribe, smack your face with the keyboard a couple of times till notification it's always. I'm gonna do immediate another video immediately after this, but I need to go have a cup of tea. My voice is kinda of fucked here. Yeah. Uh check out all the links in our description. Our Genshin Impact account is up right now. So uh, it's actually up. I mean we've been bragging about this fucking account for months now. There's no videos on it yet, but the video that is supposed to be uploaded on it should be done like in the next day or so. Or it should be up already. I don't know. Time is weird. We like we record videos way in advance, and then when the video is uploaded, it's way later than the time we recorded the video. So time is all warped and shit for us. But uh, yeah, pray for me. Damn it! There's no way I'm going to let myself start to death in you. You don't have a choice. You don't have a choice. You you acting like the sentence is going to make a difference. You just you. To, I'm your conscience, man. I'm as angry as you right now. Do not you. Yeah, I'm about to slap shit out of you, man.